Welcome back to the Brembo channel, better known as Travis Benjamin. So for this video we're talking about all new NPCs 25, 26, and 27. So for the collections 25, 26, and 27. This is just glitched out, but this is all the NPCs as far as Chapter 2 Season 8 um, go. They have not been released yet, these last three. But I assure you I know who they are. Number 25, Ember. E M B E R Ember. I'll leave all this in the description as well. Number 26, we have Sledgehammer. Okay? Now, and number 27 is Shadow Ops. Let me show you the locations. NPC number 25, the map location. It's going to be Ember, which is located right here, above Corny Complex. Literally, right here. Ember will be located right here. All right, next NPC, if we look at the collection, number 26, will be located right by this tree, and that's going to be Sledgehammer. NPC number 26, Sledgehammer. Then we have the collection, finally, 27, which is going to be um, NPC 27, Shadow Ops. And Shadow Ops will be located right over here so you'll be able to get all of these NPCs um, if you didn't know the middle uh, convergence is going to turn into a pyramid all of these cubes are going to stack into a pyramid which is pretty cool you gotta get a banner and stuff for that um, one final thing that I'll say that's a little bit confusing um, nothing's confusing about these these about two hours time you'll be able to do these punch cards um, what's confusing is I already received a career reward that says met every character during season 8 just like when I did all of the fish caught every fish type but I already said completed all of the NPCs but yet I did not because um they're not out yet so in about two hours they'll be out uh, let me go ahead and give you what the quest will be so that way that you guys know exactly what quest that will be for Amber Sledgehammer and shadow ops so the quests are going to be first i'll start with um uh, sledgehammer so for sledgehammer the first one is open a chest in the sideways this is going to be for the punch card you need to open the chest in the sideways just one chest for sledgehammer then the next challenge eliminate different types of cube monsters in the sideways three um num the third challenge Damage cube monsters with a minigun, 150 damage, so that should be easy, um, or if it looks like maybe say, um, 1,500 damage for eliminate, uh, but I think it's just 150 actually, yeah, 150, sorry. Then we have collect cube monster parts, um, you need to collect a total of 30 parts, and that, I mean 50 parts, 50 parts, sorry. 50 parts for the epic quest and then the, finally the legendary for the punch card to finish that punch card for sledgehammer is defeat a boss cube monster in the sideways so you need to, need to defeat a boss cube monster so that'll be one of those big uh big bosses whether or not you defeat cube assassin or whether or not you defeat that big boss with the long arms whatever they call him um then so for the next npc um, I'm just giving you the challenges for the other NPC Ember, which is located right here. Um, the um, challenges are as such: the first one, destroy a fireplace at Lazy Lake, Craggy Cliffs, Holly Hedges, or Pleasant Park. Just one. Um, destroy a fireplace. So inside of the houses, a fireplace. Just go inside of a house, destroy a fireplace, and you're done. Then set structures on fire. Ten. Um, easy probably just to grab at Weeping Woods, um, Fireflies, throw them in, that's set structures on fire, 10, that's the second challenge. Then the Ember's third challenge, each one of these challenges by the way will grant you 30k XP. Then you need to emote within 5 meters of a vehicle that's smoking. So just damage a vehicle until it gets ready to smoke but not blow up, and then do an emote next to it. Then for the epic challenge, the fourth one. Ignite an opponent with the firefly jar, so you know just burn an opponent, so maybe down an opponent, 
um, would be easiest if you're carrying fireflies, if you're having trouble, um, or just you know throw firefly jar and uh, light another team uh, ignite an opponent on fire. Then you need to heal from a campfire, and you need to do a total of heal. It looks like this. Um, maybe uh, it looks like 15. It's a little hard to read because um, I'm going off of leaks and such, but like 15 um, is the uh, amount that you need to heal from a campfire. Or maybe you need to heal from 15 different campfires. Yeah, that's what it's going to be because 15 looked too small for me. So heal from a campfire. Imagine if you stoke it, it will count for additional. So just go to a campfire, start healing, and then continue to stoke it. And you'll get to 15, you'll complete that, and then you'll be done with Ember. And then finally, Shadow Ops as the final NPC. Um, Shadow Ops, which will be located over here at Lazy Lake. Um, you need to visit a Guardian Tower. So visit a Guardian Tower. These are like the Guardian Towers, all of these things. Um, there's a Guardian Tower over here, um, right here. Um, so Guardian Towers, you guys should know what these are. Um, there's one right there as well. Um, they were big major thing. Uh, there's also a guardian tower right here So you need to um, uh, visit a guardian tower for shadow ops just one um, That's the first challenge then collect light ammo medium ammo and shells So that's three so the light ammo Medium ammo and then shotgun shells. That's the second challenge done then for shadow ops the third challenge cause shotgun damage to cube monsters in the sideways 150 um, the fourth challenge is just epic. Get a headshot with a pistol. Just one. That's the epic challenge. And then eliminate an opponent with an SMG. Just one. So that's very easy for Shadow Ops. And that's all of the new NPCs. And those will be in the game with the punch cards available to you. Um, here in a few hours. Um, because right now, as you look and see, if I go to my quest... 1 hour 28 minutes. So these will be live in an hour and 28 minutes. If I go in here and I look right now, they're not available. Everything else is completely done. More punch cards coming soon. So the update just dropped. So by the time you watch this video, you will, will be able to do it. 1 hour 28 minutes. So don't think this is clickbait. These are legit locations. If you think they're not legit, okay, cool, but I'm telling you, you know, you'll find them where I showed you, and the challenges are the challenges that I showed you. And if you need to look at a fishing collection or having fish mission, um, I have uh, a video I can make for you. Um, I already made the video. I'll leave an end screen. That way that you can, you know, go after the fish. My next video is going to be um, uh, all about the cube challenges so for my next video i'm going to give you page one and page two um i'll let you know every challenge you need to do um in order to get that uh these quests completed unlock cube monster the back bling and all of this stuff i mean cube queen um so i'll catch you guys in the next video with this cube queen video next up after this all right brembo ggs and i am out peace